Well, the runners are currently making their way in the uh, direction of the boxes here at Doncaster. And the favourite is trout for that's Rosanda Blake, trained by Ken Everett. And has been a very popular greyhound in recent times. Actually has been favourite on two uh, recent starts. Ultimately was uh, well held last time out, but does have a 28-24. That sort of clock would be good enough to land the spoils here, but of course not quite as simple as that. Looking on the inside, Scarlet Beauty, one of 13 from 57 starts, trained by Ricky Overton. And a winner last time out, that was when securing a B5 in 28-24. Had been favourite the time before that, actually finishing behind Foil Bandit, who does reappose this afternoon in Box 5. On that occasion, Foil Bandit was in Box 4. Well, the market certainly looks very sweet on the claims of Rosanda Blake and Scarlet Beauty against the field. As we are now rapidly approaching post time, so final chance for any bets, please. On the 3.58, we're on to race eight. And they are now going in. So going in at Doncaster, racing post, as you can see in the top left of your screen, they like trap one to beat four. No real surprise in that. Kilbarry Ty, who is actually coming back from a recent fall but has got four in better grade, is their third choice. Now at the moment, just trying to get the two dog in. Local bus is just proving a little recalcitrant. But in we go. All set then for race number eight at Doncaster. Starla checks them over, gives a flag a shake, and the hare is on the move. Hare running in Doncaster. Favour on this occasion, trap for Rosanda Blake. And we're off and racing as they charge towards the first turn. Kilbarry Ty makes a good break, and as they go round the first bend, just about going to get round, but here goes Scarlet Beauty. There's a trouble at the back for Foil Bandits. So Scarlet Beauty going on from Kilbarry Ty. Then just behind them is Local Buster. A couple ends to Rosanda Blake. Then towards the back, Salem's Bewitch, and the back marker is Foil Bandit, who's got it all to do. But as they're off the third turn, it is still Scarlet Beauty, and if anything, it's going further clear. Local Buster is back in second, but this is all about the red jacket. Scarlet Beauty wins it readily. The two will Local Buster is in second, and the four, Rosanda Blake, is in third. One, two, four, the order in Doncaster for race eight. Here's a replay then from the South Yorkshire venue. And a decent enough start from Scarlet Beauty. It was initially Kilbury Ty who did all the early work, but predictably it got very, very tight. There's no room out wide for the five foil bandit who just got involved in a sandwich between Rosanda Blake and Sam's Bewitched, but this allowed open road for Scarlet Beauty.